hello everyone welcome to the next video and in this video we will see mcqs from unit number 3 which is actually our object modeling in software engineering so first question is what is the primary purpose of a structure diagram in uml option is to represent the behavior of a system to document coding standard option c is to visualize the static structure of the system and last option is to design user interface option c is correct the primary purpose of a structure diagram in uml is to visualize the static structure of the system option c is correct next question what is the primary goal of user interface design option c is correct to enhance the user experience and user usability we actually design the user interface next question which of the following is not a phase in the unified process so in uh, implementation is not the phase not a phase in the unified process option d is correct next question what is the primary purpose of object modeling using uml option b is correct to visualize software architecture is the primary purpose of object modeling using uml next question what is a use case in the software engineering so use case is actually a representation of a sequence of an action a system performs so c option is correct here moving to the next question which phase of the unified process focused on establishing the project scope and requirement option is inception elaboration construction or transition option a is correct inception next question in uml what does a solid arrow connecting two classes represent so solid arrow in the uml is actually represent association option d is correct next question what is the primary purpose of use case modeling so the primary purpose of use case modeling is to represent system functionality from the user perspective option b is correct next question which of the following is not a standard diagram in uml class diagram activity diagram code diagram or sequence diagram option c is correct code diagram is not a standard diagram in uml next question what is the purpose of coding a standard in software development option is to ensure consistency and readability of code to optimize database performance option c to design user interface option d is to document use cases option a, a is correct to ensure consistency and readability of code next question what is the primary goal of code review techniques option b is correct code the technique the primary goal of code review technique is to identify bugs and defect in code next question in uml what does a dash arrow connecting two classes represent is it inheritance composition aggregation or association option c is correct aggregation is represented by dashed arrow in connect uh, in, with connecting two classes next question what is the purpose of a elaboration phase in the unified process option is to establish the project scope and requirements to design user interface to create prototypes or to refine the architecture and mitigate risks so option d is correct to refine the architecture and mitigate risks next question which uml diagram is used to represent the flow of activities in a system so class di no activity diagram is used to represent the flow of activities in a system option d is correct next question what is the purpose of class diagram in uml so class diagram is used to visualize the structure of a system in terms of classes and their relationship option c is correct 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच फेज ऑफ यूनिफाइड प्रोसेस फोकस्ड ऑन डेवलपिंग एंड टेस्टिंग द सिस्टम इंसेप्शन इलाबोरेशन कंस्ट्रक्शन और ट्रांजिशन कंस्ट्रक्शन इज द फेज ऑफ द यूनिफाइड प्रोसेस फोकसिस ऑन डेवलपिंग एंड टेस्टिंग द सिस्टम सो ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट हियर मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इन यू एम एल वट डॉज अ फील्ड डायमंड एट द एंड ऑफ एन एसोसिएशन आर रिप्रेजेंट ऑप्शन ए इनहेरिटेंस कंपोजिशन एग्रीगेशन और एसोसिएशन ऑप्शन बी इज करेक्ट कंपोजिशन इज फील्ड कंपोजिशन इज अ फील्ड एट द एंड ऑफ एन एसोसिएशन एरो रिप्रेजेंट नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट इज द पर्पज ऑफ अ सिक्वेंस डायग्राम इन यू एम एल सो सिक्वेंस डायग्राम इज यूज टू विजुअलाइज द इंट्रैक्शन बिटवीन ऑब्जेक्ट ओवर टाइम सो ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट हेयर मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग इज नॉट अ बेनिफिट ऑफ यूज केस मॉडलिंग ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट इनहेंस यूजर इंटरफेस डिजाइन इज नॉट अ बेनिफिट ऑफ यूज केस मॉडलिंग मूविंग टू द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच यू एम एल डायग्राम इज यूज टू रिप्रेजेंट द इंट्रैक्शन बिटवीन ऑब्जेक्ट ओवर टाइम सो सिक्वेंस डायग्राम इज यूज टू रिप्रेजेंट द इंट्रैक्शन बिटवीन ऑब्जेक्ट ओवर टाइम सो ऑप्शन बी इज करेक्ट Moving to the next question, what is the primary goal of the inception phase in the unified process? Option A is correct. The primary goal of the inception phase in unified process is to establish the project scope and requirements. Option A is correct. Next question, which UML diagram is used to represent the static structure of a system? class diagram is used for that so option a is correct so this was all about the unit number 3 make sure to watch the last video also in which you will see or you will find the mcqs of previous year previous year mcqs we will discuss in the last video so make sure to watch those videos also thank you so much for watching the videos bye, -bye.